here guys and welcome back. It's the Weymouth Street Massive here. It's Ben. I've got with me Ethan. What's up? Uh, and we come down to the Les Phillips Cup final um, to watch two teams to battling it out for the chance of a trophy at an end of a long season. Bridgewater United and Cabri Athletic. Um, it, it's going to be interesting. It's going to be a, a good game. That's what we're hoping for. Um, Warmits uh, obviously uh, are out of the competition. They beat uh, Devizes, then uh, one on penalties against Lebec, which is uh, on the channel. If you want to go and watch it, good game that one. Um, and then we lost to Almondsbury, who later lost out again um, against an upper division team. Uh, both of these are in the division above. Um, so both really good sides uh, Cabri finished 15th in the league whereas um, Bridgewater finished 5th so opposite ends of the table interestingly enough 10 places between them uh, but both have made it to the final and you know, at the end of the day it, it's club form that counts isn't it so we'll see what will happen but if you haven't already like and subscribe down below join the channel you don't want to miss it uh, we have maybe one more one more uh, vlog lined up for this season um, so don't do not miss it uh, if it comes about it will be an absolutely awesome uh, one so like and subscribe join the channel and we'll see you in just a second for our prediction so it is prediction time here at Wells City's ground um, and it's Cabra Heath against Bridgewater United um, and a bit of history for you uh, although recent history uh, Bridgewater United who were previously Bridgewater Town made the uh, 1920 final uh, here or not here but in the Les Phillips Cup um, although that was played in 2020 2021 they lost it um, didn't didn't win it Brad, Bradford Town did uh, so this there's a bit of history here for them um, and they'll really be wanting to uh, to secure a victory here and make amends for that cup final loss um, back then. Uh, also, I, I, I think Bridgewater have had the better um, bre better form finish to finish off the seasons, four wins and five. So, um, yeah, I, I think this is going to be really interesting to see who can pick up. I'm going to go for a 2-1 Bridgewater win. Um, I think it'll be cagey, it'll be tight, but I reckon they'll get the win. What are you thinking? Uh, I think 2-0 two new, two new to uh, Bridgewater. I think Bridgewater finished um, fifth in the league. Cabri Heath finished 15th. So, um, yeah. And like, to be fair, Bridgewater deserved this after being in the final last season. So, yeah. We'll see you then. So, it's going to be a good one. Stick around. Uh, and we'll see you in just a second for the start of the game. half time here um, and it's been an entertaining game that's without a doubt um, opportunities for both sides I'd say that two it should be 2-1 really I feel uh, there were two header opportunities but one for either side one was spectacularly saved at the opposite end and uh, one was um, at, at the keeper when it probably should have been put towards either of the uh, corners um, but I'd have to say the, the, the final chance was probably the best of them. Got the ball out of the corner, got it free to the centre. Just nobody, nobody could get to the line quick enough to slot it home. Um, so missed opportunity there, um, and that that was that was for uh, Cabri Heath. I'd say they'd probably been the, the slightly better side off off the face of things. Um, just had a couple more opportunities. I mean, uh, there's definitely you know an element to which either side could take it. Uh, Bridgewater have definitely been far superior from set pieces. You know, they cause absolutely mountains of trouble down the other end with their corners. Um, but it could be interesting. What do you think, Ethan? Yeah, I, I think both sides have um, played really well. They've had good chances. Both save, good saves from the keepers. Um, I'd say 
Bridgewater started off stronger, but I think Cadbury Heath really came into their own um, towards the end. So, but yeah, like you said, anything, anything can happen. Like there doesn't seem to be like a massive favourite. They all seem very even, which is very good to see. I think, yeah, I'll sit with two 0 but I don't know who that's going to be. It's going to be interesting, that's for sure. So uh, stick around for this one, and we'll find out who win wins this. Uh, we'll see you in just a sec uh, for the second. Oh! 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 Just about over the line. It is the end here. It's 1-0 to Bridgewater United. And I mean, I think it was fully deserved after that, that second half, particularly how they came out after half-time. Um, Cabri Heath couldn't get the defence together for some reason. I don't know what, what went on, but um, just loose balls, um, misplaced passes, communication was lacking, something wasn't working. Um, and, and they got their goal, that's all they needed. I mean, it barely crossed the line, it was close, but... You know, they got that goal and that's all they needed and they hung on in there. Uh, you know, Cranberry Heath came at them for the last 20 minutes but just couldn't seem to connect oh, with anything. But, um, yeah, well done to uh, to Bridgewater. And, I mean, you know, they, they couldn't quite take it all the way in the 2019-2020, uh, that final when it was played a year later. But, you know, they, they've... Uh, They've got it now. They've got that final win, and I mean, it was it was a performance, wasn't it? And I mean, congratulations to all at the club. What do you think, Evan? Yeah, they've finally done it, haven't they? <laughs> yeah. um, I was actually getting some wedges when the goal went in, so I missed it. <laughs> but I came back after, like, obviously the goal went in, and like, yeah, the Cabri Heath players were just lack of communication, arguments, not no togetherness, just blaming. Um, yeah, they sort of fell apart. And, um, yeah, I thought Bridgewater just sort of like eased off the gas because they knew the job was already done. Um, yeah, there was no way Cabra Heath were going to score. So. Well done to Bridgewater, they finally get their trophy. And, uh, yeah. Yeah. I mean, I, it's great to see, and, and that's what we all want to see for, for obviously our team warm and stuff. But I, I, I'd expect Cabri uh, and and uh, and Bridgewater to, to have good seasons next season. I can see potential in both sides, particularly in that first half. Um, so yeah, big game, big result for Bridgewater. Uh, good to see. I've been the, we've been the Weymouth Street Massive. I've been Ben. This has been Ethan, and we'll see you very very soon for another vlog. See ya.